A Catholic Sunday Mass readings for February the 13th, 2022 and every third year after that. The sixth Sunday in Ordinary Time, Year C. The first reading is from the prophet Jeremiah. Thus says the Lord, Cursed is the one who trusts in human beings, who seeks his strength in flesh, whose heart turns away from the Lord. He is like a barren bush in the desert that enjoys no change of season, but stands in a lava waste, a salt and empty earth. Blessed is the one who trusts in the Lord, who, whose hope is in the Lord. He is like a tree planted beside the waters that stretches out its roots to the stream. It fears not the heat when it comes. Its leaves are green, its leaves stay green. In the year of drought it shows no distress, but still, still bears fruit. The Word of the Lord. Responsorial Psalm is Psalm 1. Blessed are those who hope in the Lord. Bless the man who follows not the counsel of the wicked, nor walks in the ways of sinners, nor sits in the company of the insolent, but delights in the law of the Lord, and meditates on his law day and night. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. He is like a tree planted near running water, that yields its fruit in due season, and whose leaves never fade. Whatever he done, whatever he does, prospers. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. Not so the wicked, not so. They are like chaff, which the wind blows, which the wind drives away. For the Lord watches over the way of the just, but the way of the wicked vanishes. Blessed are they who hope in the Lord. The second reading is from the first letter of St Paul to the Corinthians. Brothers and sisters, if Christ is preached as raised from the dead, how can some among you say there is no resurrection of the dead? If the dead are not raised, neither has Christ been raised. And if Christ has not been raised, your faith is in vain. You are still in your sins. Then those who have fallen asleep in Christ will perish. If for this life only we have hoped in Christ, we are the most pitiable people of all. But now Christ has been raised from the dead, the first fruits of those who have fallen asleep. The word of the Lord. Alleluia, alleluia. Rejoice and be glad, for your reward will be great in heaven. Alleluia. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Jesus came down with the twelve and stood on a stretch of level ground with a great crowd of his disciples and a large number of people from all Judea and Jerusalem and the coastal regions of Tyre and Sidon. And raising his eyes towards his disciples, he said, Blessed are you who are poor for the kingdom of Get for the kingdom of God is yours. Blessed, blessed are you who are now hungry, for you will be satisfied. Blessed are you who are now weeping, for you will laugh. Blessed are you when people hate you, and when they exclude and insult you, and denounce your name as evil on account of the Son of Man. Rejoice and leap for joy. On that day, behold, your, your reward will be great in heaven, for their ancestors treated the prophets in the same way. But woe to you who are rich, for you have received your consolation. Woe to you who are filled now, for you will be hungry. Woe to you who laugh now, for you will grieve and weep. Woe to you when all speak well of you, 
or their ancestors treated the false prophets in the same way. The Gospel of the Lord.